Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back, it's your girl Jazz, and today I am doing a comparison video with Arby's French fries. Strictly Arby's, no other options. So, in case you haven't heard, and yes, I am the weird person that actually goes to Arby's. Don't sleep on Arby's, it's actually pretty good. Anyways, so they have some new fries out. They've always been known for their curly fries, which seem to disappear, because this is exactly what I got in the bag. That's my story, and I'm sticking to it. <laughs> I can't even say that with a straight face. We're gonna do a taste test comparison between the curly fries and the new Arby's crinkly fries. So we're gonna start out, we're gonna do it without any ketchup because usually I don't eat ketchup with my fries. Not saying that there's anything wrong with if it. If it's seasoned really well, I don't need ketchup. So we're gonna do a little taste test. New crinkle cut fries first. Versus curly fries. Huh, I like how it's to see you too. <laughs> yes, I'm very corny like that. All right. Scene one, fight! Clearly I've seen Mortal Kombat, or I've been wanting to see Mortal Kombat this week. I haven't had a chance to. Mm. I'm sorry, I ain't even got to eat this fry, and I can already tell you who the winner is. Curly fries. The only way that the crinkle fries would win in this competition is if we're going over quantity over quality. The crinkle cut fries has no flavor other than salt. Which, I mean, it seems like just about all fries are like that. Unless, of course, they're seasoned curly fries or they're seasoned fries. But I don't know. It just, it needs something, it needs something else. It's just plain. Maybe we need some sour cream. Oh, never mind. I'm thinking about baked potato. Never mind completely. Wrong form of a potato. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna try it with ketchup. Am I the only one that eats fries like this instead what? of having to like dip it or something like that? Am I just that weird? I know. <laughs> I'm sorry. I cannot eat seasoned fries in general with ketchup. You're just watering down the seasoning. It just, no, you don't do that. Or you're drowning out the seasoning. It, no. The reason why the season is there is for flavor. That's why ketchup is here, for flavor. That's my two cents. Curly fries, hands down, the winner. And no, I will not put ketchup on curly fries. Especially if they're seasoned. Alright guys, I'm going to enjoy the rest of my fries. Whoever wants the crinkly fries, they can have those. I'll go ahead and enjoy. In the meantime, stay tuned and stay jazzed. Also, let me know what your opinions are. Ketchup with seasoned fries? Please don't be a weirdo. Okay? Thanks guys. <laughs>